to science icon now we discussing about variation of mass with velocity there is a variation of mass with velocity in relative that the mass varies with the velocity when the velocity comparable with is the velocity of light let us drive that discuss the variation of mass with velocity let there are two initial frames hence reference frame s and s dash as is the stationary frames of reference as s dash is moving with a frame of reference at t time m t equals to t dash equals to zero so at that starts with a starts they are that observer o and o dash consider after are the s frames stands moving with a o in uniform velocity v along x axis suppose there are two particles a and b a a and b moving opposite direction and in frame of frame s velocity of a particle will u will be u u of particle a and and minus u b will minus u according to observer o let us study the velocity and a mass with this particles in frame of reference s velocity of a is u1 and velocity of a in u2 in the initial frame velocity of a a is u1 and velocity of b a is u2 in initial frame s this are given by the relative addition of velocity of relation relative addition of velocity of relation listen then respectively u equal 1 equals to u dash plus p divided by i 1 plus u dash b all divided by c square equation number 1 and u2 equals to minus u plus v divided by 1 minus u dash v by c square equation number 2 let m1 and m2 is mass of a particle a1 and mass of particle a and b a the frame of of reference s respectively at a particle are moving to each other or at a center instant they will collide and momentarily come to rest but even when but even when they come but even when they come at a rest they traverse with the velocity b e of the frame m s that is b according to law of according to according to conservation of of momentum conservation of momentum momentum before collision p before collision equals to u p momentum after collision thus m1 u1 plus m2 u2 equals to m1 plus m2 u m2 b or m1 u1 minus b equals to m2 
q two minus b equation number three putting equation one putting equation one two and putting equation one and two in equation three we get m equal m one equals to u u one plus b divided by one plus u one b by c square l minus b equals to m two u m two under bracket b one b minus minus u dash plus b wall divided by one minus u dash b by c square then take lcm of terms of perfect solve we get m m one divided by one plus u dash b c the whole square equals to m two u one by one minus p one u one b by c or m one divided by m two equals to one plus u dash p by c b by c square at one minus u two b by c square equation number four equation number four now is squaring the equation now square equation one then divide both side at pi c two then equation one and and subtract both side subtract both side by one we get one minus u one square at by c square equals to one minus under bracket u dash as plus b by c wall divided by one plus u dash b by c e the whole square by taking lcm by taking lcm on la arches and solve solved we get 1 minus p1 square divided by b c square equals to 1 minus u square b square by c minus u square and by c minus p square by c wall divided by 1 1 plus u b dash b by c equation number 5 similarly by squaring similarly by squaring adding similar d by squaring equation 2 then dividing both side by c square and subtract both side by 1 then we get at 1 minus u2 by square by c square equals to 1 plus s u dash whole square b square by c square minus s 
u square by c square minus b square by c square as divided by as well divided by 1 minus u dash p by c equation number 6 next on dividing on dividing in equation 6 by 5 we get one minus as u2 square divided by c square world divided by one minus u1 square c square equals to one plus u dash b by c square here the whole square world divided by one minus p square L B by C square wall divided cos square taking square root put in both side taking square root in both side in square root in both side both side we get at 1 minus v2 square divided by c2 wall divided by 1 minus u1 square divided by c2 2 1 by half power 1 by half power equals to 1 plus u1 v by c square divided by 1 minus u dash v by c square equation number 7 now comparing equation 4 and 2 now comparing equation 4 and 2 4 and 7 we get m1 divided by m2 who equals to 1 minus p2 square by all square power 1 by 2 world divided by 1 minus u2 square by c square world divided 1 by 2 equation number 8 this is more compli complicated result to make the result simple tell okay let we assume that the particle b is the start at rest in the frame s that is 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 zero velocity before collision this thus u2 equals to 0 and m2 equals to m0 when the number m0 is rest when m0 is rest then mass of particle become m1 and then equation 8 become m0 1 divided by 1 minus v square by c square 1 by 2 also assume u1 equals to 1 and m1 equals to 1 m1 is equal to m also assume m u1 equals to 1 and and m1 equals to m then equation 8 become m by m naught equals to 1 by 1 minus p square by c square to power half uh, then m equals to m naught divided by i 1 minus p square by c square to the power half this is equation represent the this equation represent the variation of mass with velocity